four square. And this is a hexagon. One, two, three, four, five, six. And the point at the top, hexagon. Good job. Pete, Jayana, and Joshua are so proud of you. You're doing so well. Okay, let's say them again. Octagon, pentagon, square, hexagon. Very good. Okay, now let's do our letter of the day. And the letter of the day is It's an R. R. Can you say R? R for rose. That's a pretty flower. Now, remember when we're getting ready to write, ask someone older than you for a sheet of paper. And you can write with a crayon, a marker, or a pencil. And do not write on the walls, always on paper. So this is a capital R, which is a mama R. This is capital R. And then this is a lowercase r, which is a baby r, Just like that. All right, now let's practice making a capital R. So. Now, understand that we're not going to learn it all in one time. We have to just practice, practice, practice in order to learn how to write it the correct way. And it's okay, but we're so proud of you for trying. Even if you don't learn it at this time, you try. And the more you practice, the better you'll become. All right, let's do this. So we're going to do a line. You're going to do a half a circle. And you're going to Give one leg kicked out like that. <laughs> okay, let's do that again. A line, half a circle, and one leg kicked out like that. Let's do it again. Line, half a circle, stop, and then you're going to draw another line going down, stop. Line, Half a circle, stop, and then another line, just like that. Very good. That's a capital R, the mommy R. Now, let's draw a lowercase r, which is the baby R. And this one is a short line and just, I would say a curve, not even a full circle. So you're going to do short line and then give him a little hat, just like that. Short line and stop. Short line and a small line, stop. Short line and a small line, stop. Just like that. Okay. Let's do a capital R line, half a circle, leg, come down, stop. We're going to go over it again. A line, half a circle, then a leg, come down, stop. And then you're going to do small line for a lowercase r, one line going down, and then Stop. Not even a full circle. Very good. I know this was kind of difficult, but at least you tried and we're so proud of you. Okay, boys and girls, since you worked so hard today, are you ready to hear a story? Now, I really enjoy reading stories. This story is called Daniel's Tiger. Daniel's Tiger, and this one is called Good Night, Daniel Tiger.
Good night, Daniel Tiger. Now, remember now, when we're getting ready to hear a story, you want to zip your lip and then turn on your ears. And Pete, Joshua, and Jayana, no talking. You want to listen to the story, okay? It was a beautiful day in the neighborhood today, and now it is nighttime. Daniel Tiger needs to get ready for bed. Ding, 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 says Daniel. Tiger wants to go for a trolley ride. Daniel wants to play, but it's time to get ready for bed. I know you want to play, Mom says as she snuggles with Daniel, but sleep is important so that you can grow. Do you remember what we do to get ready for bed? Daniel smiles and sings with mom, bath time, PJs, brush teeth, story, and song, and off to bed. Ding, 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 hop aboard for a trolley ride to a bath time, dad says. Daniel laughs and takes a ride. Ding, ding, Daniel wants to play, but it's time to get ready for bed. Hmm. Daddy wants to play, but it's time to get ready for bed. Dad says, you need to go to sleep at bedtime so that your great big imagination can rest. I do have a lot of imagining I want to do tomorrow, Daniel says as Dad dries his fur. Daniel sings, bath time, PJs, brush teeth, story, and song, and off to bed. Daniel has taken his bath, and now it's time for his favorite trolley PJs. Next stop on the trolley ride is brush your teeth, says Dad. Daniel takes his toothbrush and hops up to the sink. Daniel sings, I got a brush, brush a brush, brush my teeth at night. If I want to keep them healthy and bright, I got to brush a brush a brush a brush my teeth. Daniel's teeth are all brushed. Let's take Tiggy for a ride on trolley, says Daniel. Ding, ding, ding. Daniel wants to play, but it's time to get ready for bed. Mom holds Tiggy up to her ear. Oh, I see, she says to Tiggy. Daniel stops playing and looks at mom. What is she talking about with Tiggy? Tiggy wants to snuggle up in bed and hear a bedtime story, mom explains. Daniel snuggles up with mom as she reads a bedtime story. Reading a story with mom makes Daniel feel comfy and cozy. Daniel is sleepy. Daniel does want to go to bed. Daniel quietly sings bath time PJs, brush teeth, story, and song, and off to bed. Then he yawns a big tired tiger yawn. Daniel does want to go to bed. Daniel is sleepy. Mom and Dad, can you sing me my good night song? Mom and Dad sing, good night, Daniel, good night. It's time to go to sleep. And when you awake, the sun will greet you with his bright and sunny face. Good night, Daniel. Good night. Everyone in the neighborhood is going to sleep too. Good night, Daniel Tiger. Good night. And good night to you, Ugga Mugga. <laughs> that was a fun story. Did you enjoy that story? Now, I hope you've enjoyed our circle time today, and I hope you get some good rest tonight. And Pete, Joshua, and Jayana are so proud of you. Until next time, bye-bye.